coffee pot evangelism does something for us. The heart of Jesus, he puts the heart of Jesus for the lost. It's a, com uh, it's a compassion for the lost. In Matthew 9, 36, it says that, But when he saw the multitude, he was moved with compassion upon them, because they fainted and were scattered abroad, as sheep having no shepherd. Verse 37, the harvest, he said, the harvest is plenteous, but the laborers are few. 38, pray ye therefore of the Lord of the harvest, that he will send forth his laborers, you, into his harvest. In other words, God's speaking to us about this. We must understand if we're going to the, the, the harvest, we must hear the bleating of the sheep, hear the cry of the Lord in their hearts. Mm. Let the cry of compassion come upon your hearts. Hear the cries of the lost, especially of the children. Look for opportunities in church, in shops, in neighborhoods. Single them out. Invite them into your house. Prepare your heart. Obey. Bring joy of, of Jesus to them. Remember this. To end with this, it takes responsibility. And the ability to, to respond to other people. If we have the ability to respond to other God gives us to the right place at the right time with the right understanding to the joy of the Lord. Then you can say, I'm, I'm, pre I'm pleased to have a part in coffee party evangelism. God bless you all.